Welcome back to Team Slate Info. We know that Greece is doing all possible things and taking necessary steps to procure military weapons and armaments to ensure they are well prepared to tackle any type of situations and risk from Turkey. All these procurements started because of rising tension between Greece and Turkey. We saw the procurement of Rafale fighters along with the plan to equip them with hammer missiles. To be more precise, in January 2021, Dassault Aviation confirmed that Greece intention to procure 6 new built and 12 used F3R Rafale aircrafts for approximately 3 billion US dollar. The next step which they took is to ensure the Mirage 2000 fleet undergoes repairs, upgrades and maintenance procedures after which they will be used to guard the Greek skies. The Hellenic Air Force has around 16 Mirage 2000 and 25 Mirage 2000-5 which would play a major role in facing any threats from Turkey. One more procurement which will be boosting the Hellenic Navy is the agreement which Greece signed with France Naval Group to purchase three FDI frigates with an option for one more for the Hellenic Navy as part of 5 billion US dollar defense package. Now all the procurements which I talked about here were from foreign countries and not an indigenous product of Greece. But now as a major achievement, Greece has unveiled a new multi-purpose surveillance drone in the international exhibition which happened recently. The drone has been named as Architus. This vertical takeoff and landing drone is a joint production between the Hellenic Aerospace Industry and three other universities. This Greece drone is capable of operating in both rescue and military operations and as per the defense sources these drones can be used to provide situational awareness of the land and sea borders of Greece. Not only that these drones can also accompany the frigates as it has the ability to immediately detect unmanned marine vehicles moving at high speeds. The Architus is able to cover up to 300 km at a cruise speed of 120 km per hour. and it can fly for four consecutive hours while the uav is designed to operate without armament it can be very well modified to carry light weaponry so that was a small video to provide information about the recent unveiling of an indigenous drone by greece it's good that greece is taking all possible steps to improve the surveillance and reconnaissance capabilities in order to protect their territory and islands thanks for watching Stay tuned to Tainsley Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.